Australia Immigration Bulletin, 8th July 2024 updates. Welcome back to another video update by Australia Immigration News YouTube channel. Today's video update is about Australian state sponsorship allocations, arrival of a new visa and much more. So watch the full video till the end so you don't miss any important updates. Stay informed with the latest immigration news. Subscribe to our channel, hit the bell icon and share our videos on Facebook, WhatsApp and X with your loved ones. The latest Australia immigration news brings updates on the state and territory quotas for the 190 and 491 visas. Queensland has seen a significant reduction, receiving only 600 slots for each visa. Conversely, the Northern Territory's allocation has nearly doubled, reflecting its intent to attract more international students. Let's first talk about the ACT and South Australia visa allocations. The ACT has been allocated 1,800 visas, split evenly between the 190 and 491 visas. South Australia is set to receive an additional 1,900 places, bringing its total to 3,200, which are also divided equally between the two visa types. It was also reported that Western Australia leads in visa increases. Western Australia stands out with the highest increase, securing 5,000 places for both the 190 and 491 visas. This surge nearly matches its previous financial year's figures, positioning it as a top destination for immigrants. Let's now talk about the new visa stream, Workplace Justice Visa. In the latest Australia immigration news, a new Workplace Justice Visa was quietly introduced. This visa allows temporary visa holders to remain in Australia while pursuing legal action against their employers. Though details are sparse, it represents a significant step in protecting workers' rights. It was reported that student visa fee hike sparks controversy. The recent hike in student visa fees has caused an uproar. The fee has skyrocketed from $710 to $1,600, making it the highest globally. This increase is intended to fund various educational initiatives, but has left many international students reconsidering Australia as a study destination. Increasing TR processing times, a growing concern. The processing times for temporary resident visas continue to rise, creating potential disasters for applicants. Delays in skill assessments are now exceeding 20 months, putting graduates at risk of visa expiration before securing permanent residency. Stay tuned for more updates on the latest Australia immigration news as we continue to monitor these developments. That's the end of our video. Please leave a comment and share your thoughts with us. Thank you for watching today's update.